Thomas. Those cars slipped and slid on the snowy tracks. Snow can be tricky. What are you doing? Thomas puffed proudly. I have a very special special. I'm to take Sir Topham Hat to turn on the Christmas lights. Percy sighed sadly. <sighs> I finished my jobs. Sir Topham Hat didn't give me a special. Thomas wished. He didn't want his best friend to be sad. He wanted to share his happiness with Percy. Then, an idea flew into Thomas's funnel. We can share my special. We can both take Sir Topham Hat to the town square. Percy's traction rods tingled. Thank you, Thomas. Wait here, Percy. I'll huff my hardest to finish my jobs, then I'll whoosh and I'll leash as fast as I can back to you. Be careful, Thomas. Snow can be tricky. Thomas pumped his pistons. Don't worry, Percy. I know all about snow. And Thomas came swiftly away. <laughs> At random docks, dock workers coupled Thomas up to a flatbed of machinery. Thank you. Now I must hurry to make wait station. I'll puff and I'll chuff as fast as can be, so Percy can share my special with me. On the way to Maithwaite Station, Thomas whooshed past Percy. Percy was waiting. I'll chuff back soon, Percy. Snow splattered and scattered all over Percy, but Thomas didn't know. Slow down, Thomas! And Thomas didn't hear. He was already steaming down the track and away. At Maithwaite Station, Workman uncoupled Thomas from the flatbed of freight. Thank you. Now, I must race like the wind to my next job at Farmer McCall's. Thomas's wheels whirred. I'll puff and I'll chuck as fast as can be so Percy can share my special with me. At Farmer McCall's farm, Thomas was coupled up to a wagon of milk churns. Thank you. Now, I only have one job left. Thomas's firebox flared. I'll puff and I'll chuff as fast as can be so Percy can share my special with me. On his way to the dairy, Thomas rattled past Percy again. Percy was waiting. Percy was snowy. I only have one job left, Percy. I'll leash back to Once again, Snow splattered and scattered all over Percy. Percy was covered in snow, but Thomas didn't know. Slow down, Thomas! And Thomas didn't hear. He was already racing down the track and away. At the dairy, Thomas was uncoupled from the milk churns. Hooray! All my jobs are done. Thomas's boiler bubbled brightly. I'll puff and I'll chuck as fast as can be. Now Percy can share my special with me. Thomas screeched to a stop at the side. Thomas was excited. Here I am, Percy, ready and raring to chuck our winter holiday special. Thomas whistled and whooshed, but no sound came back. Thomas was puzzled. Percy? Where are you, Percy? Percy wasn't there. Percy had disappeared. Percy, where are you? We mustn't be late for Sir Topham Hat. But Percy didn't answer. Now Thomas was worried. Thomas puffed and peered at the siding. All he could see was white, white snow and no Percy. Cinders and ashes. Now Percy can't share my special. And I'm late for Sir Topham Hat. Just then, Gordon roared by. Snow from the track sprayed and splashed all over a bush. Thomas was surprised. Bubbling boilers. Now that bush looks like a snowball. Then Thomas gasped. Trembling tracks. I know why I can't see Percy. I must have covered him in snow when I whooshed and whooshed past. Thomas looked hard at a big snowy shape in front of him. Percy, is that you? 
Suddenly, some snow slipped away. Percy, it is you! Percy was sad. Hello, Thomas. I thought you didn't want to share your special with me. Now my firebox is gone out, so I can't come with you. Thomas felt terrible. I'm sorry, Percy. You were right. Snow is tricky. And I don't know about snow at all. Thomas looked at his snowy friend. Then, an idea popped in his pistons. Percy, I'll puff back soon. I promise you will share my special after all. Thomas puffed into Natford Station. Sir Topham Hatt was waiting. He was dressed as Santa Claus. Thomas jiggled with joy. Sir, I have an idea that will give the children an even bigger winter holiday surprise. So, Thomas told Sir Topham Hatt about Percy. We can take the party to Percy. That's a grand idea, Thomas. Pump your piston. Sir Topham Hatt turned on the Christmas lights. The children clapped and cheered. Now, children, all aboard! Thomas has a special surprise for you! Thomas puffed up to Percy. Percy looked sad. Then, he saw Thomas and the children. I promise to share my special with you, Percy. Children, here is your winter holiday surprise! Percy the Snow Engine! Percy beamed from buffer to buffer. The children cheered and waved. They had never seen a snow engine before. Hooray for Percy! Hooray for Even Sir Topham Hatt.